Hello everyone, this is the McGuin77 here, and welcome back for some more Let's Play Command and Conquer. So last we left off, we finished off the GDI campaign and did the absolute nightmare that was GDI Mission 15. But now that that's all done, we still have the Nod campaign to do, so let's uh, dive into that right away here, start the game again. And here we are once again back to this screen, except this time we are going to be choosing the Brotherhood of Nod to play on this time. Yes, doing the Nod campaign, which I am... Honestly, more excited to do than the GDI campaign, but yes, here we are, playing as Nod, and without further ado, let's just get into it, let's see our first mission brief. so here we go. Brotherhood of Nod, selected. Brotherhood of Nod. <laughs> so, you're the new addition to the Brotherhood. Well, I'm Seth, just Seth. From God, to Cain, to Seth. I am his right hand, and I have a task for you. This is Nakumba, and he is causing the Brotherhood much grief. His views do not coincide with ours, and that makes him dangerous. Silence him. All right, so <laughs> there we go. Going in and killing Nakumba, and uh, one thing to notice right away is that we're in a new environment here, yes. Hello, the desert environment, instead of the grassy environment that you were playing on before in the GDI campaign. Yes, the desert environment. And one can probably tell by seeing the, the unique flora here already with the trees, that we're probably fighting somewhere in Africa. And indeed we are, yes. We are fighting in the northern Saharan deserts of Africa this time, as opposed to the European map that we were playing on when we were doing the GDI campaign, which is pretty cool. We have ourselves an actual different location, and to fit that location, as we all see here, we are playing in a different environment, which is pretty much the theme, or going to be the theme for these campaigns here, where there was kind of cool how they did it. They had the GDI campaign playing in the one grassy environment, while we have the Nod campaign here playing in the desert environment. But yes, here we are in the first mission, is going and killing the Yukumba. A very, very easy, straightforward mission, guys. It is the first mission, so we do start ourselves with, I believe, 16 minigunners, as well as two Nod buggies. And, uh, yeah, now that we're playing as Nod this time, we're going out and killing those GDI bastards, yes, those GDI scumbags, yes, give them you, you rebel scum, yes, yes, playing as the Nod commanders, and, uh, yeah, but Nod troops that were commanding this time, very nice. And so, as you might imagine, in this campaign, things will, are mostly going to be the same, but we'll play out a bit differently. Uh, for one, this campaign is a bit shorter than the GDI campaign, where it's only 13 missions as opposed to 15 missions that was the GDI campaign, but, however, the Nod campaign has always arguably been the more difficult campaign to play, and uh, while there are definitely more missions where you don't get a base, actually almost twice as many, so that will definitely prove to be uh, rather challenging, as there are, there will, yeah, there will be more scenarios in this campaign where we're, the odds will be against us and we'll have to go with what we got, really. And including this mission here, because yeah, that's uh, one thing that we have already, is uh, a mission that we actually don't get a base in the first Nod mission, uh, instead of the GDI first mission where we did get a base. Nope, in this one it's uh, just us going down and uh, down killing this Nakumba guy. Which is pretty much nothing serious, it's just a, a band of civilians pretty much, which we should be coming up on a small civilian village coming up soon. But yeah, our job is to assassinate him, nothing more or nothing less really, and uh, and yeah, basically destroy everything in our way. And it's a very, like I said, very easy mission uh, to the point where it's pretty much impossible to fail. So yeah, really no worries here guys if you're new, you know, it's very, <laughs> just command your troops to go this way, very small map too, like this is the entire length of the map, so yeah, there's really, really nothing to worry about, you can take it easy here, I pretty much your biggest threat here should be one, a single Humvee, which is, should be coming up any second here, uh, they should have one Humvee somewhere, it should be like, on this bridge maybe, yep, there it is, let's go ahead and take him out, and then yeah, once that's taken care of, there's pretty much all the GDI forces, and we have ourselves a small village here, and uh, 
and like I said, since we're playing as not now, we're the ones going in and killing the villagers and destroying the villagers. Yes. yes. We know all the fun things. Yeah, very good. But yeah, there's, see, we have this village here, and um, another thing too is uh, since we are playing on a different environment now, the desert, we actually have. As you can see, different themed civilian buildings. Whereas these buildings uh, look very much different from the type of civilian buildings that we would encounter during in the GDI campaign. Like, uh, for one, we seem to have a lot more straw houses and uh, what looks like wells and clothes clotheslines. Well, I'm assuming that these, that's what these little things are clotheslines. It is hard to tell since it's an old ass game, but yeah. They're definitely different, and yeah, this this type of clay sort or stone house here, definitely different from the type of civilian house that we were used to seeing in the GDI campaign, which is cool, you know, another thing to fix things up. And yeah, again, since we're not, we're the ones going in and killing them. Yes, we're the bad guys. Yes, going in and killing them. And there's actually, even though it's not really necessary in this mission, there will be later missions in the Nog campaign that will actually require us to go and kill civilians too, so... There will definitely be in that, so yeah, don't, uh, don't fret people, there will, there will be plenty of innocent civilian massacring the government this campaign here, just, uh, all in good time. But for now, let's just enjoy our little victory here, like, go this sweet innocent village. And then Nakumba, which he should be up on this little mountain, this little hilltop. Yeah, that guy right there. Nakumba, that's our guy we need to kill. But let's just, uh, for the sake of, you know, being the bad guys and all, and all that, we'll just go ahead and destroy all of the civilian buildings and then we'll finally finish them off. And then that'll be this mission done, yes. Uh, very easy mission, and uh, a well-deserved one too, from that last freaking episode that we did the last GDI mission. So freaking on, I think, yeah, I do deserve a good break here with having some short missions. As that's pretty much how, you know, things will be as expected. The first few missions here in Nod Campaign are going to be pretty easy and straightforward. So yeah, there's definitely that. So let's go ahead and kill him and finish the job here. Yeah, go guys and kill Nakumba for me. Very good. Alright, mission accomplished. Very nice. Alright, so that's the very first Nod mission complete. Very straight, straightforward and simple mission. Very nice, and uh, we actually got ourselves a bit of a different screen here. Or so is actual people dying, and then we got a commando blowing up a GDI construction yard. Very nice. So yeah, that's this mission done. Very nice to end it off here. So with that being said, I think I'm gonna have to end it off here, folks. So yes, thank you so much everyone for watching. If you like the video as well as the other videos I upload on here, then don't forget to drop a like, comment, or subscribe. Because I upload videos almost every day, so be sure to hit that bell and get those easy notifications. And be sure to stay tuned for next time for when we get into more of the Nod campaign here. Yes. Now that we got the very introduction out of the way, you're going to be getting into the good stuff. But only soon. Very, very soon. But until then, very glad to end it off here. So, yes, finally, the Send of the Queen 77 signing off. And as always, Take care, everyone. Goodbye.